What's up, everybody? Welcome to another edition of The Breakdown. Uh, definitely, you guys get out there. Definitely go follow me on Twitter. Uh, Twitter at, uh, at OKCBoy. Same as it is on here. Um, um, but let's get into it. Uh, Canelo Alvarez defeats uh, Angulo. Um, I didn't really watch the fight. Um, so, but I did catch the tail end of it. I was able to pull it up on online, uh, at the very, very end. So I did catch the, the, like the right at the end of it is when I pulled it up and I'd seen Canelo got the win, um, by stoppage or by TKO. So he defeats Angulo and by all accounts, we'll probably never see Angulo on pay-per-view again. Uh, at least not a pay-per-view main event, maybe, Maybe something along the lines of, uh, you know, undercard. You know, maybe he'll be in Pacquiao or Mayweather's undercard. But, you know, we probably would never see uh, Angulo on TV again. So, I want to get into uh, who should Canelo Alvarez fight next. And I think that he should fight Manny Pacquiao next. He should fight Pacquiao next, win or lose. If Pacquiao wins the next fight or loses the next fight which the fight against Bradley is not going to be easy for Pacquiao, even though I think we all think that, you know, Pacquiao probably won the first one when he fought against Bradley. It's not going to be easy. But uh, I think Canelo Alvarez should fight Tim, uh, Manny Pacquiao next. And I think Floyd Mayweather should fight Timothy Bradley next, if Bradley wins. Now, um, and then, of, of course, if Floyd Mayweather beats Maidana. But um, I think I think this would be an interesting fight uh, if Canelo Alvarez fought Manny Pacquiao. Um, now the differences are uh, the only things that I could see getting in the way. Uh, Manny Pacquiao is a Bob Arum fighter, and and of course Canelo Alvarez is a Golden Boy fighter. So Bob Arum and Golden Boy. As we know in the past, they have not, business-wise, they haven't gotten along. Um, some fighters, they can get along. Some fighters, they can't. Another thing that I could see maybe tripping it up is, uh, you know, Canelo's, I don't know if he has a contract with Showtime like Floyd Mayweather does, uh, but Canelo has fought a lot of his most recent fights on on the Showtime pay-per-view, and Pacquiao is fighting a lot of his most recent fights on the HBO pay-per-view. But I definitely think that this is a fight that, definitely needs to happen and in my opinion Pacquiao won't be able to beat Canelo Alvarez just my opinion uh, from what I see uh, he won't be able to beat him I mean Canelo pretty much showed us that you know he can take a loss to Mayweather and then bounce back and then come back and get a win unlike people like Victor Ortiz uh, unlike Zab Judas uh, unlike uh, Ricky Hatton uh, unlike Shane Mosley, all these guys, after they fought Floyd Mayweather, they were never the same again. I don't know what it is, but like, it just seems to be when, when Floyd fights people, uh, they're never the same again. Like it's, it's almost like he, it's almost as if they lose to Floyd twice. Like they lose to Floyd and then they lose again to somebody else. Maybe they just can't real, maybe they just can't fathom how they got beat. But obviously Canelo's a little bit different because he bounced back from the Floyd fight to get a win uh, versus Angulo, which I figured he was going to get the win anyway. So that's why I really didn't tune in to watch the fight. Um, to me, it really wasn't wasn't as big of a fight. Um, the fight probably even shouldn't even been on pay-per-view. But, you know, I guess you can call it what you want to call it. Um, but anyway, like I said, just to get back to the subject, um, I think... I think I think uh, Canelo should fight Pacquiao next. I think that's a fight that would draw a lot of numbers uh, on both sides. You know, you know, anybody from Mexico is always going to draw numbers. And then, of course, you know, Pacquiao. Pacquiao has his, uh, his, uh, you know, he has his strong fan base. Uh, I, I don't, I don't know if his fan base is talking quite as much ever since he got knocked out by, um, by. Uh, Gosh, who did he get knocked out by? I know who he got knocked out by. I'm just losing it right now. But ever since Pacquiao has got, ever since he got knocked out by uh, Marquez, Juan Manuel Marquez, uh, is, I haven't seen his fan base around. They're kind of silenced. So, um, but I, I, yeah, I definitely think that, uh, you know, Pacquiao, 
and Canelo Alvarez would make for a, 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 a blockbuster fight because, you know, anything that, you know, the, the fight was probably only on pay-per-view because Canelo Alvarez was on there. And, you know, he, he, he is a young and upcoming uh, fighter, uh, and people know, definitely know who he is. He has some solid wins on his under his belt. He has fought in Mayweather. And so uh, who, 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 who do you guys think would, would be the outcome if, or first, not even the outcome, do you guys think that Canelo should fight Pacquiao next? Now, I, I don't, or, or, or do, do you guys think that, do you guys think that that's a fight that should happen? And if it does happen, who do you guys, who would you guys see uh, coming out, coming out on top of that fight? I'm out of here.